Welcome to the shortwave radio channel and uh, just wanted to uh, talk about a few radios that I actually took out of the dust <laughs> almost. So um, I'm going to play around with four radios, all pretty much the same size uh, when you look at them. Pretty much all very small, lightweight portables. So um, I thought that this could be fun to use some of the old ones, especially two that I haven't used in a while, one that I haven't used in a long time, the Texan PL310 here. So this is in, uh, it doesn't have single sideband. This is one of the first um, small portables from Texan that I purchased. Uh, so this is gonna be um, fun to tune around with and compare with others. Uh, the next one also is a Texan, the Texan PL380. This one's going to be fun to use the ETM functionality, the easy tuning mode, and check out what it can receive. So this is going to be fun also. Um, I will be using with that the RadiWow R108 uh, for the purpose of maybe testing that out with two Texans next to each other, see if it is it better, is it the same, how it will perform. Which one overloads more or less, or uh, that's going to be kind of fun to test out. And because I like to uh, play around with single sideband, and of course for testing purposes and comparing also, I took out the uh, C-Crane uh, Skywave SSB here. So this uh, is going to be fun to play around. So you see the alligator clips, they all go to my sloper. So all of the radios are going to be using my um, roughly 80 feet long sloper in the backyard uh, about 22 meters long 23 meters long something like that so this is going to be a lot of fun and uh, this is my uh, radio testing that will happen on this saturday night uh, today saturday september 5th 2020 as i uh, start uh, to enjoy my day and just having fun with radios um, so the three at the bottom don't have single sideband, none of them, but they are, I believe they're all general coverage receivers, if I'm not mistaken. And um, it's going to be fun to play around with also old radios that I don't use much. Uh, it's always cool to, you know, turn on an old radio that uh, you left behind. And, you know, it goes into my, um, my way of using them also. I often mention that one of the things I like to do is a rotation of the radios. I hate to see a radio on the shelf not being used for a long time. Uh, I mean, the radio's there, I, I gotta use them. The only radios I don't rotate much is, are the ones that are really crappy. Those I tend to kind of uh, just leave on the shelf. But for the ones that actually perform okay, uh, this is, uh, you know, they, I use them regularly. So, of course, I'll have also a um, personal opinion and personal uh, compare of each radio and what you know I find of that's good or bad with each radio and how to compare and uh, I think I'm, it's going to be a lot of fun to do this tonight. If you enjoy my videos please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, thank you for watching.